Hey, I've got something way different for you guys today. I played the first level of this game, and it's like one of the best games I've ever played. I have to play it. I have to record myself playing it. Um, I played the first level, and I literally said to myself, I can't not put this on my channel. It's just so amazing. The problem is I want to play the first level again. Oh, okay. Pretend you didn't see that. Trepang! Trepang, right? Trepang. Um, can I restart the game, please? Is that an option for me here? Can I delete all... There we go. I have to wait 10 seconds. That's pretty shitty. I mean, I don't really want to delete my save data. I just... What is... Return to safe house. I I've only played the first level, alright? So I don't really understand the game. Um, I, I doubt I did anything significant playing the first level. Let's just delete all save data so I can play the first level again. Seamlessly. Oh, uh, Trepang! Yeah, Trepang. Trepang's a really amazing game. I played the first level. Let's do it. So, I can't remember what difficulty I played on, but I remember it being too easy. I think I played on hard, so I'm going to try very hard. Because hard was just a little too easy. Something I loved about this game right off the bat is that the guns are loud, and the enemies scream in terror when you shoot them. It's very immersive. Alright, so I have kind of a funny story about this game. I watched one of my favorite streamers play Fear 1, and I thought to myself, man, this game looks amazing, I should buy Fear 1 and just play it for myself, and maybe if I like it, I'll record myself playing it. So I bought, I, I researched it on Steam, right? I looked up the Fear 1, I looked up Fear 1, oh my god, I looked up Fear 1 on Steam. You can't buy Fear 1 on Steam. If you want to buy Fear 1 on Steam, you have to pay $50 for the Fear Bundle, which includes every Fear game and every Fear DLC. And I've, I don't want to play Fear 2 or 3, I've heard those are terrible games. So, I, I bought it anyway, because I wanted to play, um, and the game doesn't even run, right? The game doesn't even run. I can't even play Fear 1, because it just runs like shit. Um, you try, I try to play it, and it, it just... Like, it's so choppy. It's choppy as hell. I looked it up, and apparently you can install, um, you can install a patch for it. I don't like installing patches for games that I have to pay $50 for. I feel like they should just run right out of the box. But that's just me. Um, it, I, it's kind of, it's kind of a principle thing, but there's also just the I don't want to install a patch from a third-party website thing. I, I know I've done modding before, but, like, I'm not that experienced with it. Um, I know a couple good websites. I can't remember the name of it, though. There's a great website where you can just paste in anything you want and it'll check for viruses. And it's not perfect, but uh, it's good enough. It, it almost always fails with mods, though, so I don't even know why I'm bringing it up. Um, what else? 
what else? Oh yeah, so I researched it more, and apparently this game is like the Fear spiritual successor, so I just decided to go with this game, and it's way better than Fear 1. I would recommend this game a million times over Fear 1, because I, I bought Fear 1 for the- or I wanted to buy Fear 1 for the combat and the bullet time, and this game has better combat and better bullet time and a cloaking system, so this game is better in every aspect. Yeah, that's my story. That's my story for this game. That's my story for tra that's my Trapang story. How do you turn on the flashlight? I don't think I have a flashlight. Something interesting about this first level is you never see this thing that's attacking all the guards. It's just you that's killing all the guards. So I have to wonder what all these guards are dying to that isn't me. Security station, you have eyes on 106. There's intel you can pick up throughout the level. All units be advised. But security security intel that I'm never going to read. Control, this is Echo 2. Should we go investigate? Negative Echo 2. You need to pull back and regroup with your team. Out. The first weapon. There is no aiming down sights in this game. The aim down sights button is just this. Um, but a much better attack is this. You can jump and kick. Never, never just melee. Just if you, if you have the option of whacking someone with your gun, do that instead. It even works on locks! I got some strong-ass legs. We got over here. Am I not supposed to go down there? Do I have the flashlight button yet? I don't think I do. There's definitely a flashlight button because a big thing about this game is that enemies will react to your flashlight, which I love. I love how reactive the enemies are in this game. Um, this is Echo 2. We can't find Subject 106 anywhere. Great. Those are the buttons. You can jump and kick. Whoops! You can jump and kick or you can slide. And those are like your two ways of disorienting the enemy with your... And Intel just on the ground? Disorienting the enemy with your... Um, appendages, various appendages that the human body has, yes. I am also human, so I know these appendages. T, T is flashlight. Be careful, enemies will see it. Yes, thank you for alerting me to this game. Is there anything cool in here? Uh, yeah, okay, I picked up some ammo. I'm glad coming in here wasn't worthless. I did this on my first playthrough, too. I mean, on my first playthrough of this level. I've, like I said, I've only played the first level, and I only played it once, and I realized I had to record playing this game. So I don't know much about this game other than what I've experienced, and I've pretty much told you everything I've experienced. So I guess there's no point in watching me. I, I must make a great content creator. I'm pressing the jump button, and it's depleting my stamina, even though I'm not jumping. That- damn, that's like, the least polished aspect of this game I've seen so far. Alright, stay behind and cover this entrance. May I copy that? On my first playthrough, I just shot them from the vent, and they literally couldn't do a goddamn I fucking missed! Oh my god, I fucking missed! I didn't know I had my cloaking ability at this point. I thought that was unlocked later. I do a lot of holding corners in this game, I'm not gonna lie. You know this guy, this guy's gonna walk forward any second. I can also see one's flashlight right around the corner. Die already, I can see you still moving around. I don't see anyone. I hesitated there, that was bad. I'm playing on very hard? God damn, this doesn't feel this feels just as easy as the last difficulty. Did I miss anything? I died a couple times on my on when I played this level, so 
Hopefully I'll- I, I do- I don't- it's not like I don't want to die. I do want to die a couple times. I want the game to be hard enough so that I feel my mistakes. I have to replay a level a certain amount of times if I'm making them. I did not feel that mistake when I missed that headshot just now. Granted, I guess I shouldn't. If you miss a headshot on someone you're ambushing, they shouldn't just immediately 180 and fucking pop you in the head. Have I been here? No, okay, this just loops around there. I didn't miss anything, did I? I think you can shoot the flower bags. I could be wrong, though. I don't think I ever ended up shooting a flower bag because I am a flower bag. Going in. Ooh, that felt like a headshot. Just lay into him. Just lay into him when you get to the there's on. Guns aren't full when you collect them, like it feels like when enemies shoot their guns and you pick up their gun, it has a realistic amount of bullets for how many they shot at you. I like that about it. So many cool things about this game. Oh, this is... I can't slide under this. Oh. That feels wrong. Something I am curious about is if I can increase my field of view. I'm not really a field of view guy, but I've heard 90 field of view is like where you want it to be for first person shooters. Sure, yeah, it's a little bit wider now. I guess I have a better field of view. Oh, the shotgun already? I didn't know that happened so quickly. You can also dual wield pistols, but... Hey, I got you back! I'm moving! Was taking my chances. I walked right into this place. I need to use my tools more. I need to use my appendages more. I'm not whacking. I'm not whacking people with my whack or whack. I've gotta do that more. I want ammo too. I could backtrack for health, but the whole point of playing on this difficulty is to be punished. Yeah, there we go. They're con they're always giving you help. They're constantly giving you help. I don't have to worry about it. Cover me, going in. What? Did that miss? I almost want to restart now. Bad. Just a little quick restart there. Oof. That was weird. He was looking at me in a weird way. I was not not prepared for it. Where's the shield guy? I don't see him. Yeah. Fair. I didn't play that well. I walked into an ambush even though I was cloaked. That's what I'm looking for. That's what I'm looking for. I want to feel it. I want to feel my mistake. Now you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to go this way. Cover and go! He's good.
I think that was it. Something I didn't try in the first level is sneaking past enemies. I wonder if I could have cloaked through these guys and just ran past them. I wonder how far enemies chase you. If I stealth through them, they'll never end up uh, catching up to me. Something else is killing things in here. Whatever it is, it's chopping them up. I feel like that door is just a tiny room right here. Like, there's a door right here and a door right here. I feel like there's just a tiny room right there. I don't know why they bothered to this guy. I really wanted to get this katana right here, but no, you just leave the katana there. As if that wouldn't be a good weapon in this situation. Maybe there's lore behind it. Maybe I know this guy because I tap him on the shoulder. Maybe it's dishonorable to take another man's katana. Keep your eyes on his mind. Hello. I got an autosave, so I'm gonna try running through maybe skipping some enemies here. Don't bitch me, you whiny schluck. Just make do with what you got and shut the fuck up. Wait, hold on, hold on. They won't know. They won't know. Hold on. I have more than enough cloak to do this. Keep your eyes on the monitors. It could be anywhere. They were trying, but the equipment is all kinds of haywire. It keeps disconnecting on us. Don't be They don't know they're like stupid. Just make do with what you got. They don't know they're stupid. They're literally stupid. They don't... They, they react to my flashlight, but they don't react to doors opening in front of them. Like, magically. Oh, I get ambushed here. Obviously, stuff's gonna come out of the elevator. He's not getting past us. Alright, team. Don't let that motherfucker get in the elevator. We gotta hold it. I shouldn't have walked out here. <laughs> I actually did slow mo, I don't know what happened. They're not dead, even though they're dead. Coming out of the elevator. Do I have grenades? I don't. I activated my cloak a little early there. Go ahead, grenade! It feels like I get more quick time. I don't remember having this much quick time. Where? What's the last guy? Someone's still alive, right? I heard someone's still alive. A flashlight. Did they come from behind? I think they did. I'm gonna get moving. Take this gun. Maybe get some ammo. 
right? Before I move on? No? I don't see any ammo for this thing around here. That was weird. I thought I just saw a warning. That was cool. I'm glad I actually managed to get through an area without killing them. Shot in the back of the head with this fucking shotgun. What are they, these guys are all holding pistols? You came at me with pistols? You thought that was gonna be good enough? This is the intel part of the level. I remember this part. Get that flashlight off. I might need to use the shotgun here. I only have 18 bullets in this thing. Oh, grenades. Wonderful. Whoops. Glad they didn't hear that. You can't lean in this game. I want to lean around the corners. I remember all the intel was over here. That's a suppressed weapon, but I tried the suppressed weapon earlier, and it sucked, but you know what? I'll try it again. The problem is everyone's wearing a helmet. You can't shoot him in the head and have him die. I wish all your cloak didn't go away when you used it once, too. You have no idea what's going on. You have no idea what's going on. should be over there, I feel like. Okay. Okay. So I'm holding the gun on my right side. And even though my line of sight might say that bullet hits there, unless the bullet is literally coming out of my fucking eyeballs... That's coming out of the right side of my body. And it's gonna hit him in the head. It's not gonna do that. That was fucking stupid. Let's get into position. It's gonna be over here, I know it. Did you hear that? Looks clear! Yeah, it does look clear, doesn't it? What was that sound? It's nothing over here! Never mind contact! He's getting away! <laughs> okay! Hell yeah, dude! Let's fucking go! Let's fucking go! You- you fucking assassins up ahead don't have shit on me! Fuck! 
fucking assassins don't have shit on me! <laughs> oh my god! I love this game, this game is fucking amazing. Lore... Lore time... Lore time... Capture means you will be forced to complete your original mission. What is that, suicide? I wonder if everything... No, I'm still in combat music. This is the end. Right here is the end of the mission, actually. There's gonna be a giant fucking fight here. Sorry to keep spoiling everything, but... This is where shit goes down. Tons of elevators. I mean, you can see it, right? Tons of elevators. I, I knew it was gonna happen way before they started talking when I first played this. HQ, we're inbound to the objective. Moving in. Take that suppressor, because I'm a badass. Watch my six, I'm up. All right, oh, fuck. Yeah, I deserve that. Thankfully, it it uh, does an auto save here after every elevator. I'm pretty sure. Okay, maybe it only does an auto save after every couple elevators. But it's really easy to practice and get good at this part. I mean, now I know they're going to be in this elevator and then in that elevator. Man, I always activate that shit too quick. I shot him in the head, he didn't die. Where? Wait, what? How did those guys get down? Oh, that guy's got a shotgun. I gotta kill him. I need a gun now. I, I need something better than a pistol. And they're already sending more. I have to be aware. Fucking oh, miss! I wanted that to be a direct impact. Fuck, I... Where's the gun? Where's the gun? Give me the gun! Dude! I thought I would be able to cock it. I was trying to hold it down. Ready? 
you have a shotgun too, I need that ammo. Yeah, I'm taking that thing. Nice, I got some ammo for it. They're sending in the big guy now. Coming out of here. Throwing all the grenades I got at him. I, I died instantly. <laughs> Hopefully I still get a recent save. I don't want to do all that again. Awesome. Okay. Yeah, that worked. That worked well. Oh, no. Okay, the big guy is still alive. I am not need Wait, what? I cloaked. You still knew I was here. Okay, good. Alpha 3, watch for friendly fire. 106 is approaching the helipad. No, see, Make now sure it's time to kill all the friendlies because these guys were here the whole time and they didn't help me at all. Alright? Alright, they don't start opening fire until that. You guys didn't help me at all. This is your payment for not helping me. This is what you deserve. This is what you deserve. This is what you deserve. Oh shit. Don't kill me. This is what you I saved all my shotgun ammo. This is what you deserve. This is what you deserve. And you get an achievement for doing this. I think it was called, and now you're gonna pay for the surgeries. So somehow these guys are gonna live through all this. Good game, good game. All right, I'm glad I could show you guys this game. Because this was amazing. I fucking love this game. So good. The pilot's the only one who lived through this. Love it, I love this game. It's a good game. And I'll upload more if I feel like it. Thank you for watching. Subscribe and like if you want to see more.